Okay guys, so today I'm doing a super easy cake to do. Obviously, if you haven't got time to make a massive cake or haven't got time to do loads of frills and it's just rich, literally with time consuming. So what I usually do is I get my uh, homegirl Betty Grover. So this is amazing, Devil Foods, um, Devil, sorry, Devil Food <laughs> cake mix. Uh, you can get this for about say two pounds in um, home bargains. It's a little bit pricey if you go to um, the grocery store, but sometimes they're on sale. So all you need is two ingredients, and I usually use kind of tango. It's uh, 330 uh, milliliters, but you only need 300. So even if you just have a sip from it, it's fine. Um, I've been trialing this for a long time. Um, I usually do it with Pepsi or Pepsi Max, uh, but I find the taste isn't that great. So when I usually do this, um, I always do it with, say, a fizzy orange with a chocolate cake, because it kind of tastes nice with chocolate orange cake. You can use lemonade as well, but if you do do, say, like a Victoria sponge cake, if you've got like a, a mix uh, that hasn't got any um, milk or any eggs or any of them kind of ingredients inside of it, you can pick them up from the, the super, um, the, the store's super cheap and you can use this for lemonade. So uh, here's how I make it. All right guys, super easy to do this. So what you need to do is put all the uh, mixture in the bowl first. So that is the Betty uh, Crocker Devil's Food Cake Mixture. And then either um, use the, the Tango or the uh, well, whatever you want to use, either that or lemonade or Pepsi, and you put it in the mixture. If you haven't got cans, don't worry about it. Just, just um, measure 300 millilitres. And just give it a good, good mix. I find it's better to do it by hand because you keep all the air bubbles into it so none of them gets mixed up. So after you've done the mixture, it's going to look really smooth, really nice. So then you just need your cake tin, either grease proof it, or I tend to uh, put grease proof paper onto it. And then obviously all you're going to do is just put this in. A lot more tidier than that, obviously. Don't usually do it this way, I'm only doing it this way for the camera. So after you've done that, you tend to preheat the oven to 180 degrees. And that's usually about, say, gas mask four. So, that's all you need. So, this can take up to between, say, 20 um, to 20 minutes to 30 minutes. So, let's pop it in the oven and see what it comes out like. All right guys, I love things when they're accidentally vegan. This is amazing. It says everything on the back with how to do everything. It's so, so easy, the mixture. Obviously this contains the eggs, which we don't need. So with this, you just need the Betty Crocker food mix and just a can of Tango, either lemonade or Pepsi. So that's all that you need right there. Okay, so this is a 425 uh, gram, and then like I said, you need 300 milliliters of uh, fizzy liquid to get this to work. Okay, 
So preparation it says at least 10 to 10 minutes, which obviously isn't because we've only got two things to use. And baking time it says here between 23 to 28 minutes. The cake usually serves for 12, but there's only four in my family and it usually doesn't get any more than that. So <laughs> it's a big cake, okay? And this here, this chocolate fudge icing, this is amazing as well. That is actually accidentally vegan as well. So let's get back to the baking. All right guys, so this is the end result of the Devil Foods cake mixture and the 300 um, milliliters of Tango. So yeah, that is, I think that looks pretty cool. I kind of stabbed the middle off there and it kind of deflated by accident, so that's kind of my fault. Usually it kind of puffs up and looks absolutely fantastic. Okay, so after doing all that, if you wanted to kind of spruce it up for vegans or non-vegans alike, I was showing before, is the, turn the light off. Okay, that is just absolutely amazing, the chocolate fudge icing. And putting that on top, is just fantastic and that's absolutely yeah that's vegan as well okay guys right guys so I hope you enjoyed this video so I put the um, chocolate fudge icing on top of the uh, chocolate cake so technically now there's just three ingredients so it's kind of come out like that okay so it's not that bad really just three ingredients, uh, three, well, three things really, not three ingredients, three things. So, um, yeah, that's the cake that I made. So, it's literally that simple. So, you've got the Devil's Food Cake, the can of Tango, or 300 uh, millilitres of fizzy pop, and that. So, that's all you have make that cake today. That simple, accidentally vegan, amazing, okay? So that's it. So that's the end of this video today. I hope you enjoyed it and I hope um, it was a massive help to create your own uh, cake. And um, give me a big thumbs up if you like this video, subscribe and ring the bell so I can make some more uh, quick and easy uh, videos to follow and uh, accidentally vegan which is always a bonus so yeah so enjoy the rest of your day guys uh, nice to see you again i'll see you soon in my next video thanks again guys bye